Okay, good morning, everybody. Welcome to my kitchen. Today is Sunday. It's uh, September 17th. It is really raining outside. We're under a flash flood warning right now. It is flooding downstairs? Oh, yeah. Oh, my husband says it's flooding downstairs. He is currently up on top of the ladder, and what he is doing is he is washing the cabinets. He bought these um, really cool brushes from Amazon that attach to a drill, and with the, um, he's using this Murphy oil soap that cleans wood, and he's cleaning all of the wood, and actually, they're, they're coming out pretty good. I don't know if he finished this one or not, but. No. Yeah, no, I don't know. You can kind of see a difference. You can definitely feel a difference. And he's going to be doing that for the cabinets as well as the window sills in the kitchen. Now today, and you can hear him doing that on that. Today my goal is to wash the ceiling. I need to wash the ceiling and start washing the walls. Now I need to be a little bit careful when it comes to washing the walls. Because if I get any of the dust on the woodwork uh, on the cabinets, then my husband's going to have to go back over them and clean. So I'm going to kind of avoid the cabinet areas for at least today so that I, I can get the ceiling done. Uh, I'm going to try to get at least the faucet. And the faucet is this part. Maybe start washing that so that there's not a lot that I'll have to do tomorrow. Tomorrow's goal is to get the rest of the walls done, clean the countertops, the stove, then we can start putting on the, um, we can start putting on, on the sheets to cover the appliances. We still need to move the appliances back so that we can wash the wall. And I may wash the wall a little bit on this side, but I've got to move everything out of the kitchen. Oh, okay. My husband just announced that he did the floor, and he's gonna go watch the uh, Chicago Bears game uh, now, which will be starting. So, in a few minutes, I'll be starting the ceiling. Like I said, there's not a lot you need to do with the ceiling. Usually, a good soap and water, or just a water and a cloth, will wash the ceiling. You don't need to wash it as if you're washing. The floor. You just need to take all of the dust particles off the ceiling. And that's what we're going to do later on today. So, that being said, I'm going to go into the living room. And I'm just going to check. We are, we've really been raining. I mean, it's pouring out here. So, we're doing, we're doing that. I'm also looking. I've been having a huge ant problem over here. But today I don't see any ants, so they're not active. And I don't know how they're getting into the pantry or why they're going into the pantry, but they're going into the pantry. And that's just the way it is. So, and I'm going to have to limit the dogs going out. I've got the, the air off right now. I may actually put the heat on just to keep the house kind of warm today because it is cool outside. It's only in the 60s today and it's not supposed to get hot till midweek. Garden videos, there's really nothing to talk about because it is raining this week so I can't give you a garden update. I will do that sometime next week. I know uh, when I posted the video today that you saw on Sunday, you're going to see this obviously on Monday. I talked a little bit about the iPhone, and I decided to upgrade both of our lines to the 15. My husband's going to get the 15. Um, he's going to get the 15 Pro regular phone. He's going to get it in blue. I'm going to get the Pro Max 15, and I decided to go with a higher um storage capacity. Right now, the phone that you guys have, are used to being recorded on, or that I record on, has a 256 gigabyte hard drive or storage on my phone. I decided to kick that up to the 512 gigabytes. So, 
it's, I'm basically going to uh, almost double my memory on the phone. And hopefully it's going to be a much better phone to record on. I'm hoping that, that that's the truth. True segment. So, what else is going on? I have no cooking plans at all for this week. We had pork chops last night, which there were... I threw them on the grill and there was a lot of videos for that. I do have lamb chops. However, I won't be cooking those today because of the weather. We may do something simple such as just doing fried eggs and toast tonight and doing something easy. Like I said, I've really kind of um, suspended the cooking videos until the kitchen is fully done and the new furniture is then, And then I'm going to do a grand unveil of the entire kitchen. We'll still do our talks. Once I'm done with the kitchen, I may give you a sneak peek of the kitchen. You just won't see it totally done. Now, my husband and I did talk about whether or not we want to leave the cabinets, the natural wood color that they are, or if we want to paint them a different color to match the walls or accent the walls. I'm not sure what I want to do because actually, I'll be honest with you, I hate these cabinets. They're kind of falling apart. These are not the ones that are up on top are not falling apart. It's the ones that are, and you can see this one especially has the tape around it. We need to get a new door and replace that. And that'll be done at some point. Probably a year, two years, or even three years, that's when I will really contemplate on replacing all of the cabinets in the kitchen with something different. And we'll we'll get into that when the time comes. Right now, that's not even on the, the to-do list. So, I'm going to go ahead and start the ceiling. I will give you guys an update maybe later on. If I don't, thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget to hit the like button and the comment button. I will ask that you please be nice with your comments. I had some person, and when I looked at their YouTube profile, they have no videos and only very little. So it may have been a stalker that just came in and commented on, on the thing and... I'm not going to say what they said, but I ended up removing it when I got the notification because it was an, I took it as an insult to me personally. And I know most of you guys that regularly comment on my videos have been great. You guys are, are really great, but I'm just going to reiterate, please watch, watch what you say or how you say it, because there are certain things that will come back and, and, I get to see all the comments before they even get posted to the uh, YouTube channel. So, anyway, I hope all of you guys are having a great weekend. I know those of you that are on the East Coast, especially if you're in the upper New England area, have been getting a lot of rain because you've been dealing with the remnants of what was formerly Hurricane Lee. You're probably now going to get the rain that we're getting, maybe in a day or two, depending on how fast this goes out. And you're going to get a lot more rain. Hopefully, after today, it'll be sunny. Uh, the internet, oh, let's, I know I'm going in a lot of different directions. The new internet now has been put into the house. They did not bury the line outside, which we didn't think that they would yesterday. Edward wants to say hi. What? It's pouring, guys. All right, if you think you want to go. I, I'm telling you, it's pouring out there. Ice, don't be out there long. Sorry, I'm not making a scream at you. Uh, the dogs wanted to go outside, but it's pouring, and my chihuahuas do not like rain. They very rarely will go outside if it's raining. So... Oh, anyway, the internet. The internet is fully put put in. Uh, we've been using it. We actually did cut ties with Comcast. If you guys are in my area or in the Midwest, Comcast is a big cable com provider. I don't know who you guys 
use, you can leave me a, a post in the comments. We kind of switched back from cable to the fiber network, which is, is what AT&T runs on. So we're noticing that it's a little bit faster. It's also hopefully going to be cheaper than what we've been paying. We've been paying a really, really high price both for the cell phones as well as, as the internet and, and uh, the cable TV. So by putting them into one bundle package, hopefully it saves us money. So anyway, I'm going to stop the video. I'm going to start the ceiling and I'll see you next time on the kitchen remodel update. Okay, guys, I'm back. I just wanted to show you guys something. I don't know how well you're going to be able to see it. I started to wash the actual door, and it actually is not looking bad. I know it, it looks yellow because of the lights that are in the kitchen, and hopefully it'll change once I put the correct kitchen bulbs in. But I'm, I'm washing the door, and I, it is brightening up. There are going to be, like, some little flaws in the door, like, over here, and that's from when we might have painted or bumped into it. But I think if we wash the door really well and clean it, it will it will stay this color. It's not going to be that bright white like I said I would like to do for the door, and there is no way to paint that because I don't have a way of removing either side of the sliding glass doors without really breaking them. But it does look good. So, I'll be back later. I'm going to do the ceiling. My husband's going to watch the game. I'll be back later to give you an update. So, stay tuned.